The genus Vaccinium has a mostly circumpolar distribution, with species mainly present in North America, Europe, and Asia. Many commercially available species with English common names including blueberry are from North America, particularly Atlantic Canada and the northeastern United States for wild lowbush blueberries, and several U.S. states and British Columbia for cultivated highbush blueberries. First Nations peoples of Canada consumed wild blueberries for millennia. Highbush blueberries were first cultivated in New Jersey around the beginning of the 20th century. North American native species of blueberries are grown commercially in the Southern Hemisphere in Australia, New Zealand and South American nations. The Colombian or Andean blueberry, Vaccinium meridionale, is wild harvested and commonly available locally. Several other wild shrubs of the genus Vaccinium also produce commonly eaten blueberries, such as the predominantly European Vaccinium myrtillus and other bilberries, which in many languages have a name that translates to blueberry in English. Blueberries are sold fresh or are processed as individually quick frozen IQF fruit, puree, juice, or dried or infused berries. These may then be used in a variety of consumer goods, such as jellies, jams, pies, muffins, snack foods, pancakes, or as an additive to breakfast cereals. Blueberry jam is made from blueberries, sugar, water, and fruit pectin. Blueberry sauce is a sweet sauce prepared using blueberries as a primary ingredient. Blueberry wine is made from the flesh and skin of the berries, which is fermented and then matured, usually the lowbush variety is used. Blueberries consist of 14% carbohydrates, 0.7% protein, 0.3% fat and 84% water table. They contain only negligible amounts of micronutrients, with moderate levels relative to respective daily values DB, of the essential dietary mineral manganese, vitamin C, vitamin K and dietary fiber table. Generally, nutrient contents of blueberries are a low percentage of the DB table. A 100 gram serving provides a relatively low caloric value of 57 kilocalories with a glycemic load of 6. Blueberries are a widely distributed and widespread group of perennial flowering plants with blue or purple berries. They are classified in the section Cyanococcus within the genus Vaccinium. Vaccinium also includes cranberries, bilberries, huckleberries and Madeira blueberries. Commercial blueberries, both wild lowbush and cultivated highbush are all native to North America. The highbush varieties were introduced into Europe during the 1930s. Blueberries are usually prostrate shrubs that can vary in size from 10 cm to 4 m in height. In commercial production of blueberries, the species with small, pea-sized berries growing on low-level bushes are known as lowbush blueberries, synonymous with wild, while the species with larger berries growing on taller, cultivated bushes are known as highbush blueberries. Canada is the leading producer of lowbush blueberries, while the United States produces some 40% of the world's supply of highbush blueberries. Commercially offered blueberries are usually from species that naturally occur only in eastern and north-central North America. Other sections in the genus are native to other parts of the world, including the Pacific Northwest and southern United States, South America, Europe and Asia. Other wild shrubs in many of these regions produce similar-looking edible berries, such as huckleberries and hortleberries North America, and bilberries Europe. These species are sometimes called blueberries, and are sold as blueberry jam or other products. The names of blueberries in languages other than English often translate as blueberry. E.g. Scots blaeberry and Norwegian blaber. Blaeberry, blaber and French myrtles usually refer to the European native bilberry v. Myrtillus wild bluets refers to the North American blueberry. Russian Golubica, blueberry, does not refer to blueberries, which are non-native and nearly unknown in Russia, but rather to their close relatives, bog bilberries v. Eulogenosum. Cyanococcus blueberries can be distinguished from the nearly identical-looking bilberries by their flesh color when cut in half. Ripe blueberries have light green flesh, while bilberries, cordleberries and huckleberries are red or purple throughout. Blueberries may be cultivated, or they may be picked from semiwild or wild bushes. In North America, the most common cultivated species is V. corymbosum, the northern highbush blueberry. Hybrids of this with other vaccinium species adapted to southern U.S. climates are known collectively as southern highbush blueberries. So-called wild 
Lowbush blueberries, smaller than cultivated highbush ones, have intense color. The lowbush blueberry, B. angustifolium, is found from the Atlantic provinces westward to Quebec and southward to Michigan and West Virginia. In some areas, it produces natural, blueberry barrens, where it is the dominant species covering large areas. Several First Nations communities in Ontario are involved in harvesting wild blueberries. Wild has been adopted as a marketing term for harvests of managed native stands of lowbush blueberries. The bushes are not planted or selectively bred, but they are pruned or burned over every two years, and pests are managed. Numerous highbush cultivars of blueberries are available, with diversity among them, each having individual qualities. A blueberry breeding program has been established by the USDAR's breeding program at Beltsville, Maryland, and Chatsworth, New Jersey. This program began when Frederick Vernon Coville of the USDAR's collaborated with Elizabeth Coleman White of New Jersey. In the early part of the 20th century, White offered Pineland residents cash for wild blueberry plants with unusually large fruit. After 1910 Coville began to work on blueberry, and was the first to discover the importance of soil acidity, blueberries need highly acidic soil, that blueberries do not self-pollinate, and the effects of cold on blueberries and other plants. In 1911, he began a program of research in conjunction with White, daughter of the owner of the extensive cranberry bogs at Whitesbog in the New Jersey Pine Barrens. His work doubled the size of some strains fruit, and by 1916, he had succeeded in cultivating blueberries, making them a valuable crop in the northeastern United States. For this work he received the George Roberts White Medal of Honor from the Massachusetts Horticultural Society. The Rabbitai Blueberry, Vaccinium Bergatum Sin. V. Ashe is a southern type of blueberry produced from the Carolinas to the Gulf Coast states. Production of Rabbitai blueberries was a focus in Texas in the early 21st century. Other important species in North America include V. pallidum, the hillside or dryland blueberry. It is native to the eastern U.S., and common in the Appalachians and the Piedmont of the southeast. Sparkleberry, V. arboreum, is a common wild species on sandy soils in the southeast. Successful blueberry cultivation requires attention to soil pH, acidity, measurements in the acidic range. Blueberry bushes often require supplemental fertilization, but overfertilization with nitrogen can damage plant health, as evidenced by nitrogen burn visible on the leaves. Significant production of highbush blueberries occurs in British Columbia, Maryland, Western Oregon, Michigan, New Jersey, North Carolina, and Washington. B. Production of southern highbush varieties occurs in California, as varieties originating from University of Florida, Connecticut, New Hampshire, North Carolina State University and Maine have been introduced. Peru, Spain, and Mexico also have significant production. As of 2018 in 2018, Oregon produced the most cultivated blueberries, recording 59 million kilograms, 131 million pounds, and amounts slightly exceeding the production by Washington. In descending order of production volume for 2017, other major producers were Georgia, Michigan, New Jersey, California, and North Carolina. Hamilton, New Jersey, claims to be the blueberry capital of the world, with over 80% of New Jersey's cultivated blueberries coming from this town. Every year the town hosts a large festival which draws thousands of people to celebrate the fruit. Maine is known for its wild blueberries, but the state's lowbush, wild, and highbush blueberries combined account for 10% of all blueberries grown in North America. Some 44,000 hectares, 110,000 acres, are farmed, but only half this acreage is harvested each year due to variations in pruning practices. The wild blueberry is the official fruit of Maine. Canadian production of wild and cultivated blueberries in 2015 was 166,000 tons valued at $262 million, the largest fruit crop produced nationally accounting for 29% of all fruit value. British Columbia was the largest Canadian producer of cultivated blueberries, yielding 70,000 tons in 2015, the world's largest production of blueberries by region. Atlantic Canada contributes approximately half of the total North American wild, lowbush annual production with New Brunswick having the largest in 2015, an amount expanding in 2016. Nova Scotia, Prince Edward Island and Quebec are also major producers. Nova Scotia recognizes the wild blueberry as its official provincial berry, with the town of Oxford, Nova Scotia known as the wild blueberry capital of Canada. 
Quebec is a major producer of wild blueberries, especially in the regions of Saguenay Lac Saint Jean, where a popular name for inhabitants of the regions is bluets, or blueberries. And Cote Nord, which together provide 40% of Quebec's total provincial production. This wild blueberry commerce benefits from vertical integration of growing, processing, frozen storage, marketing and transportation within relatively small regions of the province. On average, 80% of Quebec wild blueberries are harvested on farms 21 million kilograms, 23,000 short tons, the remaining 20% being harvested from public forests, 5 million kilograms, 5,500 short tons. Some 95% of the wild blueberry crop in Quebec is frozen for export out of the province.